As we close in on the general election, we've come to the streets of Bristol to find out how people are going to vote and what has been their driving forces behind their decision. We want to know, are you going to be voting in the election? Absolutely I'm voting and I think everyone should be as well. The general election is coming up. Are you going to be voting? Uh, yes, I will. So are you voting in the general election tomorrow? 100%, yeah. And how have you thought the um, sort of election campaign has been unfolding in the weeks leading up to the election? What do you think about it? Um, well, I've not had that much time to look into it. A bit of a mess, actually. Very confusing. I think this is a, an election that the, the youth and the younger generations need to get behind uh, to, uh, to, to stop some uh, more ulterior motives from uh, alternative parties. I'm not 100% sure about it all really because I just feel like it's just going back and forth with everything and all the issues and it does just seem like all the politicians are just blaming one another and I just want the truth from politicians really because that's what I you know, want as a young person especially. Talking about the election campaign and you said it was quite confusing, um, how have you found sort of taking the information on board and deciding which way you're going to vote? Uh, thinking about my family's future really, so listening to what's happening with obviously the basic things like a health service and, and I guess who we can trust as well has been a big thing throughout the election campaign. The education system as well, I think there's not enough um, funding, anywhere near enough funding going into that, there is not enough funding going into the welfare system for uh, those less fortunate. I think that for me personally every party has um, you know, a stance that will appeal to a certain part of the public, um, but for my values and, and who I'm voting for, um, there's certainly a party in mind. However, there, there's no party that has gone without scrutiny uh, and me sort of interrogating them because I think politics in general is quite questionable right now.